You remember when I told you guys, instead of getting this, you can get this for a fraction of the price and still get the compliment factor that you're looking for if this is your cup of tea? Sometimes it's just these mass appeal basic designer-ish scent profiles that get all the compliment factors that don't require you to spend 120 to 180 bucks on a designer fragrance, cause who's gonna know what brand you're wearing? <laughs> Baby. We all got secrets. But I recently got put on to Axon Intense, which is another $30 flanker off of this one, which apparently is a little bit of a darker version than this particular scent and has more maturity. Only one way to find out. Let's roll my the music so we can check on Axon Intense, a $30 budget, but of what fragrance inspiration? I don't know. Listen, one of my beautiful peoples, you know who it is. It's your boy, C3U3B today. Shout out to the perfume box for sponsoring today's video and sending this fragrance over as requested. Axon Intense by Dumont Paris. Let's see what's up with this particular fragrance because I did look up the notes of this scent and they are definitely a lot darker, a lot richer, and a lot bolder. But here's the presentation. It's a full black bottle. And again, it's all about the cheapy hype. These are fragrances that are not necessarily gonna give you niche style quality, but they're geared toward mass appealing, compliment grabbing, budget conscious scents that don't require a ton of thought process behind it. Kind of the dumb reach, easy to grab and go, throw in your gym bag, spray it on and hope it performs well and doesn't smell like an alcoholic mess. Now the original Axon Ultimate was a hybrid in that YSL Y space. Youthful energy. I said the age demographic for this particular scent profile is somewhere between the ages of 18 to 25. I feel like that's the sweet spot of the scent profile that this is gearing towards if you're looking for that mass appeal budget conscious scent. But this one has notes of the following. We got cinnamon, cardamom, and apple, followed by chocolate, cedar, and aquatic notes, then iris, teakwood, and vanilla. Now that sounds pretty interesting for 30 some odd dollars, but is it though? Let's jump right into this particular fragrance and see what kind of hybrid, tribrid, or what fragrance inspiration it's taking a note of for Accent Intense and Armani Stronger With You. Okay, definitely darker, richer, bolder, and I just broke the test strip. Literally, just waving it around, I broke the test strip. I must have saturated it a little bit too much. Armani Stronger With You and a blend of, this is like an Armani hybrid family. Armani Stronger With You and Armani Code Profumo. So the first thing that pops in is the iris, chocolatey nature with a big blast of cardamom and vanilla. This one is absolutely more my speed. The other one is just younger again, 25 to 35, I've done past that age demographic. This one is darker, bolder, richer, definitely more of a date night situation. The apple here is beautiful, crisp. It almost leans a little bit green like Granny Smith apple. There's a lot of uh, allspice blend in here, not just cinnamon as listed in the notes. There's definitely a little nutmeg and coriander element. It's almost apple pie-ish meets vanillic extract with a good amount of salty aquatic element. Let me pick up Armani Code Profumo because I'm getting some of that element mixed with Stronger With You, but I don't have the Stronger With You original. Correction, it's more of Armani Code Absolute and I have the Stronger With You only. I just want to get some sort of brain stimuli going to see which one of these it leans a little bit more towards. I think it's gonna lean more towards the Stronger With You original. I don't have that bottle. I feel like I do have the bottle, but it's just, I have an absolute mess. You don't wanna work. You just wanna make noise. No, it won't be the only one. Let me check the code absolute. Little bit, a little bit. It's definitely hybrid. Hmm, interesting. You know, my brain interpreted it in one way, but I'm wrong. I'm gonna re-smell it. I'm gonna figure this out. See what way it leans more. You know what, let me test this on skin real quick, just to get more of an interpretation and idea of the scent profile, see how it does on the skin, and see if I can figure out specifically. Cause I thought it was leaning a little bit towards Armani Code, the OG, but then I'm like, no, it's Absolute, and no, Absolute wasn't the one that tickled. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. In the sillage right now, I'm getting stronger with you. It's gotta be. It's gotta, no, it's stronger with you, 100%. It's no hybrid, I stand corrected. Strong with you, 100%. Sexy, dark, mass appealing, date night, sweet, not overly clawing, doesn't smell hot mess. There's a little bit of a mentholic undertone in here that isn't mentioned. There's a nice crisp green herbal energy coming off this joint. On the skin it smells 
I mean 30 times better than on that test strip. The skin, you're getting all the details of the fragrance. There are no sharp edges. Doesn't smell like a performance beast. Let's keep that clear. Smooth, sexy, mysterious, dark, beautiful cardamomic energy, vanillic vibes, lavender punch, a little bit of a salty aquatic gem. Bro, this is a vibe off the skin. Test strip is garbage. I'm trash. Stronger with you for 30 something dollars. Oh bro, this smells like my scent of the day, Gaga. This smells like my scent of the day, Baba. Ooh, yeah. Bro, there's no way. This is what I'm talking about. This is the shit with the lack of creativity coming out of designers and even some niche brands. This is why these budget options are becoming so wildly popular nowadays. They're doing comparable performance. Long gone are the days of the shitty cheap oils that you rub on your skin, the highly pungent alcoholic vibes. There's nothing that you're gonna be turned off about this scent, including the price point. Absolutely a ball sprayer. I mean, there's just, it's a no fucking brainer. No brainer. Test on your skin. The test strips are just letting me down over and over. I love y'all mother suckers from the heart. I'll put a link in the description if you're interested in this for the youthful vibes who are budget conscious and looking for a sexy date night fragrance. Absolutely in option. If that stronger with you DNA is something that you tested at a department store but just didn't want to give up that 98 to 125 dollar space, 30 some odd dollars. You're welcome. Let me know, have you jumped on the budget bandwagon or are you still now, I need a label, I need a designer or I need a niche to make me feel complete. I'll see y'all snitches next time. You know who it is, biggest in the game. Smooches. For all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse, we don't talk on my mom's crib. It's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would.